So this is the night before we get our new cat, Tinker. Tinker comes from a home where um, her guardian um, died from a smoke-related disease. Um, well, a heart attack. Not really that. There's more to it. Like, the doctor said it had to do with smoking, and it was, you know, kind of graphic. So I won't get into it. Um, but, um... Then we're going to go ha have four cats, and we have had four cats before, but I have two behavioral cats, and the vet suggested that, like, I'm going to possibly need Prozac for one of them, um, and the other one's a lap, a lap cat, and <laughs> so I'm a little bit stressed because I already, like, have to... Um, spend a lot of time with the cats which is fine cuddling and stuff but um you know like I spend a lot of time with the cats um which is great um because I don't work this is my job this is what I love I'm on disability that's my choice that works for me I can do that on days when I feel super anxious and you know panicky I can do that when I feel you know, not good, like a depression, too happy, um, whatever it is, um, and, um, anyway, that, that's like my only fear is, um, that I feel full with the three cats we have, um, and then there's this other issue, um, which has nothing to do with anything, the smog, this is smog time from the forest fires out in, like, Halifax, um, area, um, and anyway, I'm like, um, I'm leaving the windows open, um, but I'm going out with an N95 mask, um, I don't smoke, um, you know, whatever, it's just, you know, um, it's the worst air quality we've had, and if you think about it, people in, like, some parts of China and India live with this every single day, and, um, one of my neighbors has COPD, and she was out today, and she's looking at me wearing my N95 mask, and she's going, oh, that's a really great idea, but she seemed fine, like, it's weird, like, um, people didn't know what to do. Like, even people running daycares didn't know what to do, and none of the info came out till later in the day, like, uh, maybe stay inside and shut your windows, but I feel more comfortable with the windows open, and if, if I'm okay, like, that helps my anxiety, um, to just have airflow. Um, I, I don't want to die of smoke-related disease, which reminds me, that this cat we're taking in um, is so smoky that my roommate and her brother are going to give it a bath because um, the guy was a heavy smoker and he smoked inside and um, apparently uh, the cat's never been to a vet but is probably neutered so my roommate's going to take it to the vet she already has an appointment um, it's a six hour drive um from, like, Sudbury, where she is, um, and, uh, to, to Ottawa, so she's gonna do that, like, tomorrow with this cat, but, um, anyway, yeah, so, hmm, that's crazy, and, uh, even, he didn't even have a proper cage for it, like, the cage was missing pieces, so she couldn't, like, actually carry a cat in there, so she had to buy, like, a $50 cage, like a tiny cage, like a little small cage at Walmart, um, because she didn't have time to run around and get, like, a nicer cage, because she thought that he had a cage, um, so, I don't know, this is just a little bit excited, but also, like, um, stressed, because I don't want my cats to be stressed, um, we are going to do the isolation period, so that's, you know, that's a week or two. Um, so, yeah, I, I hope it goes well, but I guess I'll update.